recap. Yay. Um, I didn't sing in this one. <laughs> but anyway, um, starts off with AJ Styles. He's, um, he's talking. He's talking about Spire Series. He's talking about how he's uh, looking forward to fighting, um, Brock Lesnar again. Yep. And then Paul Heyman. Fluffy, fatty, freaking penguin. Comes out. Well, he was wow, by wow. the um, he was yeah, by the announce was, table. Yeah. So he showed up out of nowhere. I'm all my. He was talking. He's gonna have the best, and he, he was talking about what's gonna happen. And he's gonna be in the corner, just you know. Yeah, because he represents a screaming girl. And Paul Heyman was talking about Daniel Bryan. And he's gonna be having a, the best seat in the house. The Sunday, and he's trying. He's trying to literally try to get on AJ Styles' side. And Styles was like, "I see what you're trying to do. I do." Um. Um. So he says, uh, "This one is gonna be the face that runs the place." Yeah, and then Paul Heyman retorts, saying stuff about Daniel Bryan, saying yeah. that he's not bad enough like Daniel Bryan. Um. And then, then AJ Styles kept talking about Daniel Bryan, and then Daniel Bryan finally shows up, and he says, "We, I thought we we got this over. We hugged it out, and all that stuff. You beat me fair and square. Yeah. And when I said all the things about you, I meant it. I respect you, but you say my name one more time, I'm gonna punch you in the face. I've been looking for an excuse to punch you in the face. And then he's like, thank you." And then Styles talking, and then he's saying, um, Paul, about Paul Heyman said Daniel Bryan, and then he's like, so he can't say, and then he's like, Daniel Bryan, and they were just going at it. It was going crazy. Then Shane McMahon, he what well, he was what he uh, almost looked like he moonwalked all the way down, and he's getting trying to uh, separate them, right? Yep. And he's getting, he's tr uh, trying to protect Daniel Bryan, and AJ Styles is kicking everything, and then they got everybody out there to try to pull him away. Yeah, even it happened even backstage after the commercial came back from the commercial, or even in the backstage. Or no, it was uh, it was Shane. It was arguing with Daniel Bryan, and they were arguing and yelling, and Paige is right there in the middle, and then. Out of nowhere, it comes AJ Styles, and then all of, almost the entire locker room is trying to hold him back. And of course, that um, so they, that's... they made Dan Bryan off the Survivor's team, and because they're gonna have for tonight Styles and AJ for the title. Oh yeah, so it's a rematch from last week. So um, and then also it said um, Becky Lynch. Won't be competing at Survivor Series against Ronda Rousey because she got so, she got punched in the face by Nia Jax for real. Yeah, she suffers a broken nose and a concussion. She's all puffy. You can see yeah, it. It's puffy, that. swollen, black, black and blue. Well, she was bloody last night. Oh, yeah, yeah, bloody was... everywhere. Every, blows everywhere. Yeah, they say wrestling's fake. <laughs> Tell that to Becky Lynch. Sometimes. Yeah, what about the like with the Triple H thing too? That was well, crazy. He had surgery. Oh, yeah. That bruise was big. Well, remember Triple H is a little bit like is getting up in age, it's where to the point where the body is, it w it will easily take more damage. Yep. And it'll take longer to heal. So, let's go on to what our first match was. It was Cien Olmez versus Jeff Hotty, and of course. Got your back and forth, back and forth action, and whatnot, and um, the front of one. Mhm. Mm then there was a then there was the talk with Nakamura. Yeah, he was doing an interview, and he was showing on his phone. Well, he was uh, yeah, he was on the phone, and he was talking about how Seth Rollins only talked talk about the match with um not their match. Only a little bit, and he was more focused on um, Dean Ambrose. 
And then Nakamura kept was like saying, I want to fight Seth and drink Seth and I don't know, I couldn't understand. That was getting a little creepy, but he's saying that he's gonna end up breaking Seth's face. He's gonna break Seth's face. Yeah. That was that. And of course, I went to the next match. Justin. Ooh, next match. The Miz versus Rey Mysterio. And here's the thing. Rika, Rika. Yeah. But here's the thing. If Ray if the Miz won the match, Ray's off the team. But if Ray well, wins, he stays on the team. Yeah. But And it was a good match. Doing a couple of moves. Ray doing his six one nine. Try and the Miz try to um pin him, but then Ray uh, reverses it and then pins the Miz and they win. And then I, after the match, still in the ring, Randy Orton comes out, tries to RKO Rey Mysterio, but he counters it, and he's and Ray, um, Randy's in shock. Miz is right there in the ring, so RKO's the Miz. Ray gets out of the ring, and Randy's just looking at him crazy, like, I'm going after you. You're mine. Yeah. It's probably going to end up being a Randy and Ray match soon. Oh, uh, we will be. Um, I probably don't know who I would go for. I'm probably sure that they, there's matches where they actually fought in the past. Probably did. So it's an old rivalry. But then, end up being, um, Paige taking, um, a couple girls out into the ring, calling them all out. Because, um, Becky has to pick somebody for her to get replaced. To face Ronda Rousey this Sunday. Yeah. She's not medically clear to fight. Paige had the Iconics, Charlotte, Naomi, Naomi, Asuka, Carmella. I think that's it. Right? Yeah, I think that's it. Yeah, that was it. Sonya um, Deville. Oh, yeah, Sonya Deville. For, and Mandy, Mandy Rose. I, Mandy Rose, I forgot her. Um. And Becky Lynch came out and she's talking and she says she had she took a good beating, but that doesn't stop her. But she um was saying that she tried so hard to make make it where she can compete, but they just wouldn't let her, so she can't. Yeah, they, she, she can't. wasn't cl uh, clinically cleared. Medically. Yeah, she's she's and then talking and talking and then she's like. Rhonda, you ain't the baddest woman. You're the luckiest woman. Mm-hmm. Yep. So she picked. So who did she pick? Who did she pick? Who? She went through like each one. She went who? Through. She went to each one, and then she went right to the one she wanted. I'll tell you who. Charlotte. Charlotte. And she said. She shook her hand and gave her a hug. No, yeah, she told Charlotte to submit. Submit Rhonda like I would. Beat her like I would. Shook her hand and hug her. There you go. And then the girls all hugged her. Huh? Hugged Charlotte. Mm-hmm. Well, they didn't hug her. They were all lifting her up, almost like like the royal seat. But, um, yeah, that was that match. Then Missy in the next match. The bar tartar sauce <laughs> with him and then Baldy with, uh, Big Show versus Flappy Jacks. It's kind of like uh, salad versus freaking pancakes. You can't have sp uh, salad sauce. with breakfast. <laughs> no, it's pretty much like lunch versus freaking breakfast. But so Missy, Missy, Missy's our favorite, and um, definitely no. what Big E oh, was doing God. in the beginning. What was oh, he doing in the beginning, oh. Missy? Thrusting his hips towards the ref, thrusting his hips towards all of them. Dumping pancake people boxes think, of pancakes on the people children. Think, people Sarah. think is Big E gay, or he just likes butts, or what is it? I yeah, don't man. know. He was doing it to the ref. I don't know about that. Well, here's the thing. But this, um, just because he's thrusting his hips and he's dancing around and stuff, that doesn't make him gay. It just it makes him energetic. He's expressing himself. Uh, it it's 2018. Him, uh, I don't know. It's don't 2018. Know. So. Um, but, but the bar won. The bar and Big Show won. Yeah, big, because they had because Big Show. Because Big Show and yep. Woods, they were the mass and they were in the one now, so. Yeah, yeah, Big Show and Matt. And then, you got the main event. 
which is for the WWE World title. Mm -hmm. Daniel Bryan, yes, yes, yes. yes. First, the phenomenal one, AJ Styles. Styles. Ooh. Um, is it like this? Right? No. Sweet. No. It's like this. This is too sweet. And this is the phenomenal. And so that match was good. It was going back and forth and back and forth. It was Styles and it was Daniel. Um, and then all they of a sudden. They were too. Yeah. Were mostly Daniel with all the scars. You see. Arm and. It was close. It like Match was exciting. It looked like he got bit by something right here on his forehead, like right between his things. It looked like he got bit by a monkey or something. I'll call out what happened towards the last few moments of the match. Uh, oh yeah, the, this at the end of the match. Um, they knocked uh, Daniel Bryan knocked into the rat. Yeah, because right? um, yeah, Silas was gonna do a phenomenal forearm on Daniel. Daniel got out of the way, hit the rest, rest knocked out, and then Daniel. It's a low blow. Kind of like Shinsuke Nakamura did. Yeah. To then, uh, Styles, and he's like, that, that's a In heel, that's a heel turn move, and he's sitting there laughing and smiling. The ref finally got up, and then he Daniel did, the did a uh, running knee and pinned him and won. So, Dave Bryan's your new, so it's going to be Dana Bryan versus Brock Lesnar at Survivor Series this Sunday. And it was still laughing. He was laughing. I think it's funny. And he beat him up after it, too. Yeah. All right. This is going to be something really, really, really messed up. We know Daniel Bryan's good, but do you think he'll... Do you think they'll be, they'll be able to pick up the pieces on Sunday? Who mm -hmm. knows? I mean... Who knows? has got to wait and see. I mean... He's never faced anyone like Brock Lesnar. He hasn't faced you mean, anyone as Brock like Screaming Girl. Hmm. That's gonna be crazy. Goat Man versus Screaming Girl. I mean, we could we believe that that match is gonna be. That's kind of a one sided match. I mean, sure, Daniel Bryan has a lot of moves in his career and all that stuff, and he came back from a career ending injury, but Brock Lesnar's a death sentence. He's gonna kill him. But he's gonna he's gonna put him in the ground. And that freaking penguin, he's gonna be like, yay. Well, and also, of course, mixed match challenge. Yay. Was um interesting, I guess. It was like the, the first match. Actually, it was a pretty much a the top two people that was on Raw and SmackDown three and oh, three and oh, first three and oh, first three and oh. On each SmackDown and Raw and whoever like that. It was Bobby Lashley and Mickey James versus Braun Strowman and Amber Moon. And Trippy was there too. Yeah, of course. But Braun Strowman and Amber Moon won. Of course. Get these hands. Yep, get these hands. hands. Like that. <laughs> but anyway, on the SmackDown side. Of course, AJ Styles is hurt because what Dan Bryan did, he had to get replaced by Jeff Hardy. And so it was Jeff Hardy and Charlotte versus The Miz and Ashka. They were having a kind of a toss up, like who they wanted. There was, some, yeah. there was a lot of them that want Randy, Randy Orton to be her. Yeah. And there was. I have a feeling it be Jeff because it's Miz. Jeff, and then there was. I forgot who else they said. There was Jeff. Or Ray. Yeah, Ray Mysterio. Someone said they wanted Ray. And there was another one. Remember who it was? There, there was quite a few that they wanted, um, but there was a lot of Randy Orton's coming up. A lot, but, a lot of um, people wanted them. People were saying because of like Charlotte already uh, made Oscar tap that WrestleMania. She did it again. Yeah, she did it again. She won for them. So it's four now, Charlotte. I think it's still Styles. I don't know. And four now, Bob, Braun and Amber. And then next week it's gonna be. Um, Carmella and our truth versus Rusev Alana. Whoever lo loses that goes home. Rusev Day. Yeah. Oh, um, Rusev Day. Day. Or Lana Day. Yeah. And, um. What are you hoping to win on that one? I think Rusev Day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. More than our truth Probably than. Rusev Day might win. Yeah, more than our truth than Carmella. Sorry, our truth than Carmella, <laughs> but I like Rusev Day more. Yeah, but, you, um, don't dance, you don't do this five second dance. <laughs> but um 
a uh, little roll, it's going to be Team Paul's, Bobby Roode and Natalia, versus Mahalisha. Now, whoever, Go Team Paul's. Whoever loses that is going home, and I think Team Paul's is going to win that. Yeah, of course it's going to win that. Mahalisha. Ugh, Magic Carpet Ride, Mercy. Yeah, Magic Carpet Ride, no way. Magic Carpet Ride's going to go bleh, bleh, bleh. With Screaming Girl. Eek! But, anyway, that was Big Mac Challenge. That was Smackdown. What did you think about it? Are you looking forward to the matches on Sunday? Yeah, Survivor Series. Who's ready for, yeah, who's ready for Survivor Series? Or War Games? Yeah. That's Saturday. Yeah, yeah, that's Saturday. That's when, NXT. Well, that's Missy, me, we watch NXT, and then we're going to do a recap for NXT War Games. Mm -hmm. But, um... All right. But let us know. Are you excited for Spicy? Or did you like SmackDown? What not? What's your favorite part of it? What's yeah. your predict? What do you guys think is going to happen on Survivor Series? Yeah, well, who do you think is going to win? What's your predictions? We're going to do a prediction video probably tomorrow. Do we really need to do a prediction video? But um, we already know what's going to happen halfway. We already know that. We know Braun Strowman's going to win. I mean. Uh, yeah. Not Braun Strowman, Brock Lesnar. What the frick am I doing? Well, because Braun Strowman should have won that. Yeah. He, sh he shouldn't have cheated. Well, that's why they're doing that. They want to get the fans riled up. They want to okay. get the fans all mad so they can go on Twitter and do huffy puckies. So, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. All right.